Hello and welcome to the Cornwall Reports news briefing for Tuesday the 19th of October. The local media headlines today and the big story of the day is going to be that protest at County Hall in Truro over plans to close four leisure centres. Local communities in Falmouth, Launceston, Saltash and Wadebridge are furious that they've been singled out for a Cornwall Council hit list. A committee meeting this morning has the power to set up a councillor-led inquiry to get to the bottom of what's been going on. The imminent arrival of half-term tourists has prompted Cornwall Council to remind people that Covid infection locally is far higher than the national average, although no one in authority has yet gone so far as to suggest the tourists shouldn't come. There's a deepening mystery over who is designing and building the Kernosat satellite, which is due to blast off from the Newquay spaceport in only eight months' time. No one seems to know what it's actually for. Cornwall councillors have been told they should try to make their staff pension carbon-free by 2045. The Belfast Crown Court trial of Corsan's Dennis Hutchings has been adjourned until next month. Mr Hutchings has developed Covid. And all four lanes on the Tamar Bridge are once more open to traffic after a five-month resurfacing project. The BBC was among the media to report a campaign to restore the town clock in Truro. The clock is more than 100 years old and is in such poor condition that it needs to be completely dismantled before it can be repaired. The Falmouth Packet pointed out that this morning's big leisure centres demo in Truro isn't the only action in the diary. There are more public meetings at which campaigners can get involved. Pirate FM reported those continuing pleas from health chiefs not to go to A&E unless your life is in danger. And finally, Cornwall Live has a list of celebrities who went to school in Cornwall. And those are the local media headlines for now. Thank you very much for watching. Do please share this video on social media. I'll be back again tomorrow. See you then. Bye bye.